Hi, it's Steve Palladino from Palladino Power Project, and I'm bringing you another video, this time uh, regarding the Google Chrome extension called RE in Stride. Uh, this is developed by David Giuliano, uh, and I've done a previous video, but he's done some uh, up updates to it. Um, and so this video is effective about... Uh, April 13th, 2020, and uh, I'm going to go over some of the metrics that, well, all of the metrics that it now provides and how it, how it works. Um, I'll also put a link in this video to the, where you get the, the uh, extension, uh, the Chrome extension. Um, so look for that in the video uh, notes. Uh, so what we have here is we have a, uh, a 5K uh, effort from a uh, a member of the Paladino Power Project Facebook group, and this is uh, Power Center, the new Power Center. And what uh, what David did with this Chrome extension was develop uh, the capacity to, to add metrics um, to this what's selected, what's the sum, what the summary metrics are up on top of the power chart but also metrics added to each lap. So what are the metrics? Well, the, the first one here is running effectiveness. Running effectiveness can be added to the top or to the, uh, each, each lap, as you see here. Um, percent of CP. So this, this um, uh, will take your critical power. Let me, let me uh, go to here. I'm going to open up the options. So I'm going to click on this icon that opens up RE in stride. Click options. I'm entering the stride weight. You want to use the current stride weight or the stride weight used for the particular um, running question. Um, I, since I look at multiple athletes, I enter their CP, their current CP associated with that run here in this box, in this entry box. But as you see, you can leave it at zero or leave it empty and um, it will draw in the user, the value that's stored for your particular power center. So it will draw in whatever's associated with uh, power center for that user. Um, but since I work with multiple athletes, I enter each individual one. But you're going to have to definitely put in your stride weight. Um, then the new features here in options, you can toggle all of these different metrics. You can talk, you can, I'm not going to toggle RE because that's what the, the basic function of the, the uh, extension is, but now uh, David's added stride length. Your critical power percentage can be toggled on or off. So percent of CP, your FPE for the top row of metrics and your watts per kilogram for the top row of metrics. So you can toggle all of those on. Um, so you'll see running effectiveness, percent of CP, uh, stride length, watts per kilogram, FPR, that's form power ratio, which is, uh, that this is a default uh, offered by Power Center. It's, it's in the Power Center app. It's already there, but I wanted to add it up here uh, so we can select it. I'll show you that in a second. Uh, but the uh, RE, percent of CP, and stride length are added to each particular lap. Um, uh, watts per kilogram and FPR up here, those are, those are added by extension, but they, they do not add on to the laps. There's just not enough real estate, plus form power ratio or FPR is already offered. Um, in, in laps. So the latter two uh, here are not um, put down in laps. They're just up here for summary. Um, 
So if I wanted to select, let's say I wanted to select the, the back half of this particular 5K, um, it will update the metrics. And you can see from the back half, there's there are the summary metrics for the back half. Click the, click on that. Let's say I want to look at the front half. Uh, just I'm just eyeballing this. Um, there is the front half, so they're they're different. It will update. So these added metrics at the top um, will light just like these default ones will will um, will update dependent on your selection, or it, it will give you whatever the whole the whole run is. Um, so. Uh, it allows you to do that, but I'm going to go back here and I'm going to get rid of this for a second. Um, and let's say I do not want stride length, and I really don't. I don't want to see stride length on top. I wouldn't want to look at, that, at it on a per lap basis if I'm looking at mechanics and stuff, but I don't want to see it as a summary, lap, summary at the top row. So... Um, I toggle that one off and I'm going to save it. Then I'm going to come back here and reopen the, um, the run file. And now stride length isn't here anymore. So we toggled it off. And because stride length also is put in the laps, it, it takes it out of laps as well. So I can do that now. I can toggle a percent of CP, watts per kilogram, and form power ratio. I can toggle those off as long as long, as well as uh, stride length. I can toggle those on or off. Um, so there you have it. It's a great, great extension for uh, just adding uh, utility to your uh, analysis of your runs um, in Power Center. Um, Hope that uh, this gives you some uh, some good information. I hope that you go out and, and get it, that extension, and use it. it it's going to um, definitely add to your capacity to um, analyze your runs. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.